Circulation going. Right. You know I got your best interest at heart. We're gonna be here for a while. May as well have something to eat. Mmm. Yeah, that's it. Eat the eggs. It's full of all that raw and juicy protein. Is that your teeth? You know what this means, right? We're going into hypothermia. Jerry said that this freezer can get down to around negative 30 degrees Celsius. And you know the human body needs to be around 37. In the positive, of course. My guess would be about an hour before we die. Ten minutes. We'll start to feel a little, uh, loosey. Shut the fuck up! Can you just shut up for one second? How did we get into this mess, man? I mean, this job, working with these morons. I don't know, man. It's just the way she goes sometimes. Bullshit. If it wasn't for your stupid cock following around stupid pussy, we wouldn't be in here. We'd still be studying, man. No, you had to throw it away. You had to start drinking, and partying, and dropping out of uni to follow around girls. Oh, come on, man, don't forget about Rachel. Oh, you want to, you want to talk about Rachel? Let's, let's talk about Rachel. Pretty girl. Absolutely lovely. Doesn't she have a kid, though? With another guy? Oh, so she dumped you. And, and, and is she still threatening you, or is that her junkie boyfriend? Because cause I can't keep up. Can we stop talking about this, man? We should seriously stop moving. First time a girl even loved me. You want to talk about it first? Remember our first hand job? The chick with a tight grip. Yeah, hey, what was her name again? Teresa Squeeze. You were right, man. I should never have got a job here. Oh, man. I know people do crazy things when they're in love. Even if she was a bitch, and did quit soon after. Yeah. I tell you what, though, I never thought we'd go out like this. We lived a stupid love. It's just dying a stupid death seems f f fitting. 